Hey guys, Nitno here. Today we are taking a look at how to build an improvised shelter. With the recent addition of shelters, we get a couple new options for storage. The stick shelter, the leather shelter, and the tarp shelter. I'll show you exactly how to make these. First off, you will need to create a shelter kit. This will be the starting point for all other shelters we can craft. The shelter kit is crafted by combining four wooden sticks and one rope. Cycle through your options until craft shelter kit is prompted. You can now choose a placement and deploy. Now that you have your shelter kit set up, you will now have a menu for your shelter site. This is the point in the process where you can decide if you want to build a stick shelter, a leather shelter, or a tarp shelter. To craft a stick shelter, we will need 50 wooden sticks and 4 long sticks. Although it will be a process, wooden sticks can be harvested quite easily from bushes. I'd suggest using a tool such as a hatchet or a knife to harvest your sticks. If you choose to harvest your sticks by hand, you may want to consider wearing gloves. This will help you avoid getting your hands cut up and having to bandage. With 50 wooden sticks and 4 long sticks attached, you can now select Build Sticks Shelter. To craft a leather shelter, you will need 8 tanned leathers. Tanned leathers can be crafted from pelts obtained by skinning animals. You will need 2 to 3 animal pelts. Combine an animal pelt with garden lime to craft tanned leather. I often find garden lime in sheds and greenhouses. With 8 tanned leather and 4 long sticks attached, go ahead and interact with the menu and select Build Leather Shelter. Lastly, to craft a tarp shelter, you will need to add 4 tarps to the shelter site. Tarps can typically be found in farm buildings such as barns and sheds. You can also check industrial buildings such as garages and factories with 4 tarps attached to the shelter site. Simply interact with the menu and select Build Tarp Shelter. All three shelters will protect you from rain and keep you dry. They currently provide 100 slots of storage space. You can pack your shelters if you'd like to move them. You will lose a small amount of materials each time you pack it though. Lastly, shelters are destructible. It took me quite a few hits to destroy a shelter, but one good grenade will do the trick. Alright guys, I hope you found this helpful. Hit that sub button for more daisy content. Also, clicking that like button really helps me out with the YouTube algorithm. As always, have fun and daisy. Take it easy. Peace.